you know, they say you can't, you can't ever uh, know what someone's living until you walk in their shoes. So Eduardo Chavez set out to find out the shoes he'd be walking in, his grandfather's, known to the rest of the world as the iconic leader of the farm worker movement, Cesar Chavez. The last shall be first and the first will be last. Cesar Chavez died when Eduardo was a year and a half. That journey turned into a documentary film hailing Caesar. Documenting my journey to better understand his legacy. It was two years in the making, fitting it was accepted to be in the American Documentary Film Festival in Palm Springs as the grape strike for farm workers' rights Chavez is famous for started right here in the valley. But Eduardo admits, before making this film, he knew little about that kind of work. Before my whole experience in, in uh, working in the fields, I really didn't know too much about farm workers. But in the making of this film, he now feels he understands a lot of things. I learned so much about my grandfather's struggles, his triumphs. I learned so much about myself and my family. Something he's now passing on. He's touring schools, showing the film, and holding Q&A sessions throughout the country. On this day, he was proud to hold a special screening for Coachella Valley High School students. I hope that I can educate young people on my grandfather's life as an activist, on his message. A message that lives on in the great fields of Coachella and beyond. The consciousness and pride that were raised by our union are alive and thriving inside millions of young Hispanics who will never work on a farm. Kitty Alvarado, KMIR News.